Hey guys, this is a demo of launching your career bot via Google Tag Manager. I created a quick bot for this one, just a single step thing, uh, because the important part is the embed code, which is here, which I'll copy paste, and then go to Google Tag Manager. Within Google Tag Manager, I'll create a tag, which is a custom HTML tag, and then add triggers to launch it. I'll launch it on all pages, and then add exceptions to it, so that it doesn't launch on certain pages. So I add a new tag. I'll call this the QB tag. And choose custom HTML because we're launching custom HTML into the website. Add a exception, sorry, a trigger, which is the all pages, which is a default from Google Tag Manager. So right now I created a custom HTML tag with a QB launch code which will be triggered on all pages. Save this one and submit and publish this one. After this, we'll add the exceptions. It's there. Now we go to my website, which will launch the QB. It doesn't have it right now. And this second page doesn't have it either, but it does have Google Tag Manager here. And it does have Google Tag Manager here as well. If I now reload the page with Google Tag Manager, it should launch the QB tag right here. And then on the other page, same thing, relaunch it. And there you go, there's the QB. So now I'll a add a exception to this page, to this tag. So back to the QB tag. This QB tag being triggered on all pages. So what I want to do is add a exception. This exception, QB set trigger, it will be a page view trigger, which will be launched on some pages. I'll choose page path contains exact, because that's the name of the page I don't want it to be loaded on. Save this one. I hear a bit of rain outside. There you go. Of course, don't forget to submit and publish the new QB. There you go. If I now go to my page right here, QB was already launched here. Just to demonstrate, it will be launched here again because that's what we want. But now I go to the accept page where previously it was launched, but now with that exception, it shouldn't. So this is a reload, and you see there's no QB on my sub page. So that's how you do it.